Hello, in today's video, I wanna talk about surrounding ourselves with the right people for the right purposes. Uh, it's kind of a confusing thing because as Christians, we can be pulled this way and that by surrounding ourselves with this group of people, this, this group of people, um, and it seems we're to do both for different purposes. I'll explain what that means in a second. Uh, for this, uh, I'm gonna pull from a couple different places. Uh, first, Psalm chapter one, verse one, the very first verse of the book of Psalms. It says, blessed is the one who does not walk in step with the wicked or stand in the way that sinners take or sit in the company of mockers. When you read this verse, it seems all right at first until you, ask, until you read the, old, uh, the New Testament and Jesus surrounds himself with a company of mockers. He sits in the company of mockers. So if we're to be like Jesus, if we're to be like Jesus as Christians, then we are supposed to imitate the lifestyle of Jesus. And he sat in the company of mockers, so we're supposed to too. But Psalm chapter 1 verse 1 says, do not sit in the company of mockers. I think some clarity can be given if we read the first, uh, the first part of that. Do not walk in step with the wicked. It seems when uh, that is said that you're not, it doesn't necessarily condemn being around them, so uh, as much as conforming to their lifestyle. We look at Romans chapter two, uh, 12, verse two, it says, do not conform to the pattern of this world. That's the first part of that verse, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind. In, in Colossians chapter, two, uh, chapter three, verse two, set your minds on things above, not on earthly things. In John chapter 17, uh, verse 16, Jesus says, I am not of the world. And if we're Christians, like, Jesus, then we're not to be of the world either. We're not to live a worldly lifestyle. So I think some clarity can be given here is that we can be around these people for the purpose of spreading the gospel to them, right? Because we can't spread the gospel unless we're around people who aren't Christians, who aren't the company of mockers, right? But we're not to take on their lifestyle. We're not conform to the pattern. We're not to conform to the pattern of their living but setting our minds on earthly things, or on, on heavenly things, not on earthly things, things that are eternal, not temporary, we are living as we should, being not of this world. We can be in this world as Christians to spread the gospel and, and to, do, to give God glory, but we are not of the world, as in a meaning that we do not conform to the world's pattern of living. So I think that that can give some clarity to that.